What's going on guys? Dreamer Boy here with another video and today we are reacting to Lil Peep, Star Shopping, and Beamer Boy live in Seattle. Now the reason why I'm doing this video, even though I did another Star Shopping video, is this is the live version. I had a comment on my last video um, saying I should react to this. So I'm going to give the people what they want and let's react to this and see how it goes. All right, real, real quick. The fact that he sounds like he does on a recording and how he does live, then like it, it doesn't really happen that often. So shout out to Lil Peep. I, it's so sad that he's gone. I'm going to say it in like pretty much every video, but like it's really sad that he's no longer with us. So let's, uh, let's keep it going and. Huh. It's like my favorite song, so I'm sorry if I uh I get to a point where I'm like at a loss for words, but I, I do have to stop right there. Thank you to everyone who's making my beats. You're helping me preach, right? Shout out to all the platforms out there that allow you to post content. Like, I use YouTube as, as my outlet. I know it's not exactly the same, but like, he got huge and grew a following and i think back in the day it wouldn't have been as easy and easy isn't even the right word because it's still hard to like become something but the fact that he was able to come up and have such a huge impact for someone that's relatively unknown um at the beginning just like a lot of artists he doesn't sound like every other artist. He has his own unique style and spin on a lot of music. And he, he's saying thank you to those that are able to help him express himself. And a lot of people would just say, it's all me, it's all me, it's all me. Like, very, very humble. And if you watch the documentary, you'll see that he's extremely humble. He wants to do everything he can for everyone else. And that actually might have been his, you know, biggest downfall because pressure mounts and mounts and mounts and mounts. But man, and then I do have some like thoughts, but we'll wait until the end of the video. Um, but yeah. So much more than gorgeous. 
So much more than perfect. Right now I know that I'm not really worth it. If you give me time, I could work on it. Give me some time while I work on it. Losing your patience and girl, I don't blame you. The earth's in rotation. You waiting for me. Look at my face when I fuck on your waist. Cause we only have one conversation a week. That's why your friends always hating on me. Fuck him, no, I did this all by myself. Matter of fact, I ain't never asked no more for help. And that's why I don't pick up my phone in the ring. None of my exes is over the peak. Nobody fucks me as much as I be. That's why she takes me and tell me she loves me. She know that someday I'll be over the sea. Making my money and smoking my weed. I think it's funny, she open up to me, get comfortable with me. Once I gotta come and I love her, she love me. I know that I'm nothing like someone the family want me to be. If I find a way, would you walk, walk you with me? me? Look at my face while you're talking, talking to me. me. Cause we only have, have one conversation a week. Let me get one conversation at least. Shout out to everyone making my beats. You helping me preach. This really is the only thing keeping the peace. Peace when I fall in the pieces. pieces. Alright, so we still have the other half of this video to go and we're gonna get to it. But I did wanna say one thing. In the documentary, he talks about how once he got the face tattoo, right? How it was kind of a make or break for him. He knew that if he gets this, you know, he has to succeed at this. He has to go after this. And I think the sad part is people will look at him, right? And see all the tattoos and, and everything and say, oh, he's a bad person, right? Because he has tattoos, because of this, because of that. And like, Again, I never had the pleasure of meeting Will Pete, so I can't speak for how he is and how, how he is um, besides music, but it always looks like he tries to have a smile on his face and like, you know, be there for everyone else. It's just that, that people think because you have tattoos that, you know, he's a bad person. And he talks about in the documentary when he got like his first tattoo, a lot of his friends' parents told his friends that they can't hang out with him anymore. Imagine being a, a teenager and having to, to, to deal with that. To feel like, oh, because I have a tattoo, no one's going to hang out with me anymore. I'm not allowed to hang out with my friends. I'm not allowed to do X, Y, Z. That sucks. We got to stop judging people for the stuff on the outside. Judge them for what's on the inside. Like, that's my, uh, what was it? My, uh, PSA. My PSA, my public service announcement. Stop judging people for superficial things. That's it. I fucked up one word, goddammit. It's okay, yeah. <laughs> Hold on. And we're going to skip ahead a little bit so that we can get into the next part of the song. Oh, fun fact. Uh, this song, Beamer Boy, that's how the adventures of Dreamer Boy came up. But yeah, you'll, you'll see why.
even fucking need a boy Baby, I'ma be my boy I'm a T3, that's a two-seater boy Okay, hold on. We have to we have to relo reload that real quick. Okay. They want that real talk, that drug talk, that I don't feel shit, right? He's basically saying, people don't want to hear about how much money you make. Girls, X, Y, Z, right? They want to know about the real stuff, not the superficial bullshit. Sorry for the language, but like, that's, that's facts. People will hear this song and like, they won't grasp that and they'll be like, oh, he's talking about like, oh, how he has all these photos, blah, 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 blah. No, not at all. Not at all. <laughs> he says at the beginning, I want a girl who don't need a man shit, right? He wants someone that doesn't need to rely on him, right? He wants to be a part of their life because they want him in their life, not because they need him in their life. But yeah, let's continue. I'm a dreamer boy. Said to see the boy. There is the end of Star Shopping and Beamer Boy live in Seattle. I hope you enjoyed. Two thumbs up. I mean, we're talking about two of my favorite songs that he's ever made. Um, Star Shopping live is incredible. It's... You, it's like you're connected to the song. At least it is for me. And again, it could just be because I'm a huge fan of him. But, man. And then Beamer Boy? I'm a dreamer boy, right? That's how this channel got its name i'm not gonna act like it didn't definitely took inspiration from little pete because he's 21 years old when he passed he's gonna have an impact that is longer than his life and not many people can say that so it's been your boy dreamer boy don't stop believing don't stop dreaming and hold on Oof. 
leave a comment down below with what you want me to react to next. I take requests. As long as it doesn't get blocked, I will upload it. Hit that like button. Please subscribe. And again, let's, let's redo that. Don't stop believing. Don't stop dreaming. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.